Hi everyone, thanks for joining me today for story time. I am so excited to be here with you today. My name is Lucy. Story time is one of my favorite things to do, so I'm really looking forward to having some fun. Before we get started, let's sing a little song so we can get warmed up, we can do some dancing and some singing. All right, ready? I'm in the mood for stories, hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for stories, hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for stories, hey, how about you? Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that today. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that. Ready for some dancing? singing along with me. Okay, now that we're a little bit more warmed up, let's get our hands up and get ready to say hello to each other. Ready? Ready to get a beat? Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as high as we can. Hello! Hands again, bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as low as we can. Hello down there, everyone. Hands again, bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as fast as we can. Hands again, bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as slow as we can. Hello. One more time, bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Okay, we've said hello. So now it's time to get started with our stories. But before we do that, we have to figure out what kind of stories we're gonna to do today. So I'm gonna grab my story box. Ready? What's inside the story box? The story box, the story box. What's inside the story box? Story box today. Oh, I hear something rattling. Hear that? Let's open it up and take a look. <gasps> Ooh, there's two little things in here. What is this? <gasps> it's a little bunny. And look at this. So tiny. Do you see that? <gasps> it's a tiny little bunny or rabbit. You can call them either one. So, we really have two letters to think about. Bunny, b, b, b. What does that start with? Do you know? It starts with the letter B. And rabbit starts with the letter R. They even look kind of the same. I'll show you on the alphabet. Here is the letter B for bunny. And here is the letter R for rabbit. 
Okay, ready to sing the alphabet with me? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time won't you sing with me? Thank you for singing the alphabet with me. That was great. Okay, for my first bunny or rabbit story, I have a story called Duck Rabbit. It's by Amy Rosenthal and Tom Lichtenheld. Okay. We're gonna put that right there. <gasps> hey look, a duck. That's not a duck, that's a rabbit. Are you kidding me? It's totally a duck. No, it's a rabbit for sure. No, look, see, it's a duck. There's its beak. Mm, it's a rabbit. Those are its ears. Huh, what are you talking about? It's definitely a duck. Look, it's about to eat a piece of bread. <sighs> no, that's not a duck. It's a rabbit who's about to crunch on a carrot. Well, Huh, wait, listen. What do you hear? What, 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 what? Those are distinctly duck sounds. No, listen again. I hear the sniffing of a little rabbit. It's definitely a rabbit. No, look, it's a duck who's wading through the swamp. No. That's not a duck, that's a rabbit hiding in the grass. Well, look, look, watch it fly. It's a duck, it's flying. Oh, it's not flying, it's a rabbit that's hopping. Which one is it? Huh? Look, it's so hot out. The rabbit is cooling off in the water underneath the sun. No, that's not true. The duck is so hot that he's getting a drink. I don't know. Let's look at it through binoculars. Can you get out some binoculars to look at it? Go like this. Here at it, what do you think? I think through binoculars, it looks like a duck. Or does it look like a rabbit? Let's call it, see if it comes. Here, duck, 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 here, duck, come on. Here, rabbit, come here, come here. Oh, I think we scared it off. Hmm. Well, I thought it was a duck, but now that I think about it, maybe it was a rabbit after all. Or maybe it was a duck. I don't know. What do you think? The end. Okay, let's do a little song together. Can you put your hands out like this in front of you and flip them over and get ready to sing with me? Open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them them open shut them lay them in your lap 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 creep them crawl them creep them crawl them right up to your chin 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 open up your little mouth ah but do not let them in 
Open, shut them, open, shut them to your shoulders. Fly, 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 higher, 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 high like birds in the sky. Falling, falling, slowly fall like raindrops to the ground. Quickly pick them up again and turn them round and round. Ready? Faster, 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 still. Faster, 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 still. Faster, 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 still. And slowly slow them down. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Lay them in your lap, lap, lap. Very nice doing that song with me. Thank you. Okay. The next funny story that we have is a classic. This one has been around even when I was a little kid. I used to read this, and it is called The Runaway Bunny by Margaret Weiss Brown. It has beautiful illustrations, which are the pictures inside. Once, there was a little bunny who wanted to run away, so he said to his mother, I'm running away. If you run away, said his mother, I will run after you, for you are my little bunny. If you run after me, said the little bunny, I will become a fish in a trout stream and I will swim away from you. See him becoming a fish there? If you become a fish in a trout stream, said his mother, I will become a fisherman and fish for you. There she is, the mother bunny fishing for her baby bunny with a carrot. If you become a fisherman, said the little bunny, I will become a rock on the mountain high above you. If you become a rock on the mountain high above me, said his mother, I will be a mountain climber and I will climb to where you are. There she goes, climbing up to her little bunny, who's a rock. If you become a mountain climber, said the little bunny, I will become a crocus in a hidden garden. If you become a crocus in the hidden garden, said his mother, I will be a gardener and I will find you. There's Mother Bunny as a gardener. There are all these beautiful flowers. Do you see the little bunny? He's in that crocus right there. If you are a gardener and find me, said the little bunny, I will be a bird and fly away from you. See those wings? If you become a bird and fly away from me, said his mother, I will be a tree that you come home to. There's the bunny bird flying away. There's the mother tree. If you become a tree, said the little bunny, I will become a little sailboat and I will sail away from you. If you become a sailboat and sail away from me, said his mother, I will become the wind and blow you where I want you to go. There's the little bunny sailboat. You see his ears became the sails. And there's the mother bunny as the wind. If you become the wind and blow me, said the little bunny, I will join a circus and fly away on a flying trapeze. If you go flying on a flying trapeze, said his mother, I will be a tightrope walker and I will walk across the air to you. There's the bunny flying on his trapeze, and there's his mother on her tightrope.
if you become a tightrope walker and walk across the air, said the little bunny, I will become a little boy and run into a house. If you become a little boy and run into a house, said his mother bunny, I will become your mother and catch you in my arms and hug you. And so she does. Aw, shucks, said the little bunny. I might just as well stay where I am and be your little bunny. And so he did. Have a carrot, said the mother bunny. The end. Hey, it is time for us to do another song. You might know this song as if you're happy and you know it. But today, since our story time is about bunnies, we're going to sing if you're hoppy and you know it, like a bunny. So you ready to do some hopping and some other bunny things? Okay, ready? If you're hoppy and you know it, hop around. If you're hoppy and you know it, hop around. If you're hoppy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're hoppy and you know it, hop around. If you're hoppy and you know it, shake your tail. Do you have a little bunny tail you can shake? If you're hoppy and you know it, shake your tail. If you're hoppy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're hoppy and you know it, shake your tail. If you're hoppy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're hoppy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're hoppy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're hoppy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're hoppy and you know it, wiggle your nose. If you're hoppy and you know it, wiggle your nose. If you're hoppy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're hoppy and you know it, wiggle your nose. Okay, I have another little bunny rhyme for us. I'm going to need your help keeping a beat for this one. Okay, ready? There's something in my garden. Now what can it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. Hear its funny sound. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Who says ribbit? A frog is what I found. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Let's get our beat going again. There's something in my garden. Now what could it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. Hear its funny sound. Squeak, squeak, squeak. A mouse is what I found. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Ready? There's something in my garden. Now what can it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. Hear its funny sound. Bagok, bagok, cluck, cluck, cluck. Who says that? A chicken's what I found. Cluck, cluck, cluck. There's something in my garden. Now what could it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. Hear its funny sound. Thump, thump, thump. Who makes a thump, thump, thump sound? A rabbit's what I found. Thump, thump, thump. The end. That thump was the rabbit hopping around. Okay, I have a bunny song for us to sing. And it's going to take place with these little bunnies over here. Should we count them? One, two, three, four, five. And what do you see on them? B-U-N-N-Y, which spells bunny. So we're going to sing, I know a pet that's soft and cute and bunny is its name. Oh, B-U-N-N-Y, 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 and bunny is its name. Oh, and now we're going to flip a bunny over. There's this little bunny tail, see that? So instead of saying that B, we're gonna clap, okay? I know a pet that's soft and cute and bunny is its name-o. 
U N N Y, U N N Y, U N N Y, and Bonnie is its name. Oh, let's flip over the U. We're gonna have to clap twice. I know a pet that's soft and cute, and Bonnie is its name. Oh, N N Y, N N Y. N-N-Y and Bonnie is its name Oh, All right, we'll flip that N over. I know a pet that's soft and cute and Bonnie is its name Oh, N-Y, N-Y, N-Y and Bonnie is its name Oh, Now we just have one letter, the letter Y and four little tails. I know a pet that's soft and cute and bunny is its name. Oh, why? Why? Why and bunny is its name. Oh, oh no, all I see are tails. So we're going to have to clap for all five bunnies. Ready? I know a pet that's soft and cute and bunny is its name. Oh, And Bonnie is its name of. Very good job singing that song with me. Look at all those cute bunnies in a row with their little tails. I have one more rabbit story for us today. This one is called Waiting by Kevin Hanks. And it's about five different animals, but one of them is a rabbit. And actually, all of these animals are something else too. So maybe while we're reading the story, you can think about what they might be. There were five of them, and they were waiting. See them all? There's the rabbit. The owl with spots was waiting for the moon. The pig with the umbrella was waiting for the rain. The bear with the kite was waiting for the wind. The puppy on the sled was waiting for the snow. The rabbit with stars wasn't waiting for anything in particular. He just liked to look out the window and wait. When the moon came up, the owl was happy. It happened a lot. And when the rain came down, the pig was happy. Her umbrella kept her dry. When the wind blew, the bear was happy. The kite flew high and far. And when it finally snowed, the puppy was happy. He'd waited for a very long time. The rabbit was happy just looking out the window. Sometimes one or the other of them went away, but he or she always came back. Looks like the pig's not there. The pig went away. Sometimes they slept, but mostly they waited. Sometimes gifts appeared. Someone gave them an acorn and a shell and a little ball. Once a visitor arrived from far away and he stayed a while. Then he left and never returned. Oh no, it looks like the elephant fell off that windowsill and broke. Hmm, does that help you think about what these animals might be? They saw many Wonderful, interesting things. They see clouds in all different kinds of shapes. Look, there's the bunny. There's an umbrella. A rainbow. Some lightning. They look a little worried in the lightning. Oh, it must be winter. There's icicles. And then in the summer, there's fireworks. And of course, there was always the moon and the rain and the wind and the snow to keep them happy. One day, a cat with patches joined them. Now there's six. 
Was she waiting for the moon? No. Was she waiting for the rain? No. Was she waiting for the wind? No. Was she waiting for the snow? No. She didn't seem to be waiting for anything in particular. <gasps> but she was. Look at that. There's actually five little cats. Four of them were stacked in there. Have you ever seen a doll like that where all the dolls are stacked in another one? Does that help you think about what these animals are? Now, there were 10 of them and they were all happy together. See the rabbit hanging off there? I think these are toys. All these animals are toys lined up on someone's windowsill. And they are waiting to see what would happen next. The end. Okay, that is our last rabbit story. So now it's time to get up and dance around a little bit. Okay, you can go ahead and dance any way you want to. Dance any way you please. Dance any way you want to. Stop when I say freeze. Did you stop? Did you freeze? Okay, should we hop like bunnies? Ready? Hop any way you want to. Hop any way you please. Hop any way you want to. could we do? We could wiggle. Ready? Wiggle any way you want to. Wiggle any way you please. Wiggle any way you want to. Stop when I say please. All right. What else should we do? Should we swim? Okay. Swim any way you want to. Swim any way you please. Swim any way you want to. One more time. Let's get ready to dance. We're gonna dance faster. Okay, ready? Dance any way you want to. Dance any way you please. Dance any way you want to. Stop when I say freeze. Very good job. All right, it is time to wiggle, wiggle fingers. Way up to the sky. Wiggle, wiggle fingers. Wave them all good. Bye. Thank you so much for joining me today for story time.